should you add background music to your videos? Let's test that theory. I can't even believe this is my job right now. I can't even believe this is my job right now. Which one of those videos was more engaging? The second, right? So this is because music heightens production value, it creates ambiance, and it sets the tone of your videos. Now, if you are not a professional video editor, where do you get free music and how do you add it to your videos? Enter Lauren. I'm gonna show you the quickest and easiest way to add background music to any of your videos using V.io. Firstly, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and create a profile. I'll pop the link in the description below. It takes seconds to get started and it's free to sign up. Now that we're logged in, click create new project, upload a file, select the video clip that you wanna add music to. It'll take a couple of seconds to upload and next we're going to add music. Now you can always sign up to a music subscription but they normally cost over £15 a month. So an alternative to find free copyright music is on YouTube. Firstly, if you have a YouTube channel, head to YouTube Studio, scroll down the sidebar and click Audio Library. You've got a bunch of free tracks here that you can download. Another option is to search for copyright free music on YouTube itself. There's a channel literally called Royalty Free Music, No Copyright Music. So once you have your music downloaded, it, head back to your Veed tab and click media and upload a file. Choose your soundtrack and you'll see it on the bar below your video file. As the song that I've chosen is much longer than my video, I'm going to cut it down. So to do that, I will drag my playhead to the end of the clip with the music bar highlighted. I'll click split and then delete the excess track. So another way to do this is to drag the edges of the track in and out to get the portion of the song that I want played. Lastly, you can turn off the audio in your video by clicking on the video and then clicking on the speaker icon. Or you can even just lower the volume of the clip by dragging the volume percentage up and down. Now that we have our music and clips sorted, it's time to export. So click export, choose your render settings. I'm gonna go for HD and export video. So once your video is finished rendering, you have one final chance to watch through and make sure you're happy. Then click download and download mp4. And that's it. That is how you add background music to any video, plain and simple. I hope this video helped you and if it did, please don't be afraid to give us a like, subscribe and ask me any questions down in the comment section below. Cheers for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!